Good morning, uh, William Falkenstein. I hope I pronounce your uh, business name, your name properly. Uh, first of all, thank you for replying to my messages. And like I said, if you're tired of posting of social media, trying to get clients, trying to uh, you know get more business, this is a good uh, option perspective, if you will. So you at least know how many people can you reach if you're showing up on Google searches, right? So the first thing that I have here is your website. And I have to say, I like the design. Very uh, nice. I like uh, I like the colors. I like the the palette color of, of the of the whole website. But the first thing that I'm noticing and you are missing, and I always say this when I see these type of websites that are good looking, but they're missing something, right? What you're missing here is content. When I say content, I'm talking about everything that is text readable in the eyes of uh, Google. So, for example, here you have text. Here you need to add in this text, in this content, um, keywords that, are pe that people are, are looking for, are typing for, right? So for example, here I see superior quality, handicap accessible bathroom installation, and then some text, but nothing um, nothing more, right? Uh, then you have some text here, but nothing really um, that is popping up. And why is this important? Because when Google analyzes this, they read through all of this right and it's not that they have an actual human being an actual human being it will be great uh, they have this software or algorithm going on and if it doesn't make sense on their end you are not going to show up on google okay i mean you you might be missing you're missing a lot of opportunities so to show you that um for example i use this tool called a reps and what this does it picks data from a website based on google criteria so for example i have your website here right and i can see that you're only being found for 61 keywords and you have around 71 backlinks. What are backlinks? This is this is the second um, most important part of this, this thing. Backlinks are other sites, other websites that are mentioning your name or your business name, and this will give you the power so you can be found on Google and keep climbing positions, okay? Think about like a popularity contest, right? The more people you get to talk about you in a positive way, in um, in a positive way, you know, the more relevant you're going to become, the more relevant you will stay. Same thing happens here with backlinks. Now, let's see what kind of keywords you're being found for based on the content of your website, all this, and the credibility that this uh, support in the eyes of our Google. So let's see it really quick. Okay. <clears throat> so ADA doors installed near me. Is that bringing you clients? Because this is more of a like um, <clears throat> national kind of thing. I don't know if you're popping up on 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 the map section, and I'll show you three little things that you um, that you have to uh, you have to improve in a few seconds. Um, again, ADA kitchen requirements. Uh, I don't know if this is bringing your clients, but you're not ranking. You you only not even in the first page for this one. But again, nothing is relevant here. What type of flooring is best for wheelchairs? Mm, I don't know. Um, and I can see here that the content that you have is not really, it's not really pointing out any relevant keywords. For example, if I go to Google and I type uh, bathroom renovation, right? Because you're part of that. The first thing you're gonna see here is this Google guarantee. It's like Google Ads. I don't know if you've done Google Ads before, um, but it's the same thing with the difference that they will ask you for your insurance information, license information, all that kind of stuff. In comparison to Google Ads, they only ask you for just a couple simple things, like this one, for example. So the difference is that Google Ads and, and Google Guarantee is just the information uh, requirements, uh, but it's the same thing. You pay every time somebody clicks on your ad. If you've never done Google Ads and you want to give it a try, you got to be really careful because even though they make it look nice and easy to set up, you can end up wasting a lot of money not seeing one phone call. Then we have the map section. Like I said, these guys are popping up everywhere. Magnolia. I always see every time I do a research here in New Jersey, I always see this, uh, these guys. Um, yes, you can be definitely here, but what do you need to be here? You need an optimized website, of course, and you need relevant content. All of this, all of this needs to be improved. All these, um, I've seen that you've been posting this uh, quite uh, constantly, three days ago, five days ago. Again, if you're doing these kind of postings, you gotta make sure that you add these uh, keywords, okay? And I see that you have 11 uh, Google reviews. I was looking at them, let's see. 
um, that was one year ago, even though if they're all reviews, if they're good or bad reviews, like this one, for example, you need to re reply, okay? Google loves to see that interaction between service provider and consumer. So even though they're all, make sure to reply because that weighs a lot on your uh, profile performance on Google. Now, I was saying this, right? <clears throat> you can definitely be here. So let's see why these guys are ranking number one. And just a quick uh, reference for you is that 70% of the people that do a Google search, they only go for the top three here and the top three here. That means that less than 30% would actually scroll all the way down to the end of the page or even go to the second or third page. So all the, all the traffic will be concentrating here. Now let's see why these guys are ranking number one and the benefits of that, right? So uh, you can see here, this is a soup page, right? And the first thing you see here is content, how they target specific keywords, NJ bathroom remodeling, and then use a random keyword with a lot of content, just the way they're doing it. Now, sometimes you, you're not gonna see <clears throat> this amount of um, content stuff in the website and specific page, for example, they do this on the blog or other um, other similar pages, like like a blog post kind of thing. And that's where they stuff all the content and they keep these uh, front pages nice and neat. But again, they have content here, they have content here, they have all this content here, they have all this content here, right? Now, to see these numbers from these guys, let's use this over here. Okay, this sub page is being found for 345 keywords and they only have 15 backlinks, but that's because the home page, the whole website is killing it, right, out, out there. They've been a long time on, on um, servicing. So here they go, bathroom, remodels, NJ. There's 200 search among them. That means that roughly 200 people search this every month because the ranking number two, actually you know, number one, I'll show you why, but because the ranking number two, they're getting 65 visits. If you ask me, those are 65 chances they get to get a client every month that is looking for this specific keyword. Uh, bathroom remodeling, NJ, a variation, right? 80 search a month because the ranking number two again, they're getting another 30. Just between these two, there's 95, okay? And what I was showing you this, for example, this takes a little bit different, the, the ranking position. So number one is the pack. So number two, this take like the local pack, number two is the organic result that we just saw. So anyway, uh, we keep going in just on bathroom uh, remodeling, right? Uh, New Jersey bathroom remodeling contractor, the 70 search a month because the ranking number one, they get another 25. So just on that is what? 120, maybe more, <clears throat> 110, sorry. Um, let's keep going. NJ bathroom renovation contractor, 60 searches a month. Bathroom contractor NJ, 50 searches a month. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, bathroom promoter NJ, 40 searches. And they know the value. They know that these are what people are looking for, searching for, and they're ranking for these keywords. Now, <clears throat> Uh, you have different uh, services here, so in different areas. Uh, I can see here that you um, are licensed in PA, in New Jersey as well, of course. I'm not sure what areas exactly are you looking for, but for example, New Jersey is not that big, so of course it's, it makes sense to target the whole state instead of uh, specific cities if there's not too much of a trend or volume search, if that makes sense. But again, you can see here, there's a lot of uh, trending between uh, bathroom renovation, um, renovation kind of a search terms bathroom renovation in j3 searches the researches and these guys are ranking number one and that's just for bathroom um remodeling right uh there's a lot more of um search volume uh let's see here your services what you have come home contact make a payment let's see uh yeah, it's a little bit confusing here. I'll call us now, a little more. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely need to um, redesign read your website. Um, yeah, um, it's a lot of things. Make it a little more easy. It takes less than two seconds for any visitor to decide if it's going to stay here, give you a call or ask for more information. So make sure that your homepage is a little more engaging and not to mislead any um, any visitors, okay? Remodeling services, for example. 
what do you have here? I saw, okay, so here my recommendation is to have a specific soft page for each one of your um, services that will help you. And also if you serve in different areas, uh, I don't know where was I, what was I looking at? So hold on. Mm, no, I think this one contact. There we go. I think it was around here that I saw. Okay. Service areas in PA, Levittown. Yeah, you need to have a specific page for Levittown, Bristol, uh, Ben Salem, Yardley, Morrisville, Langhorn, uh, Penda, and all, all of this. Okay. So make sure you have specific pages for your services, specific pages for the areas that you are targeting, um, including New Jersey. Because here I don't see anything New Jersey targeting kind of thing on the homepage. Okay, so I don't want to take too much of the time. Um, I know I cover a lot, but there's a lot more to keep covering. Um, if you um, if you have any questions, please let me know. And like I said, you need to improve your website. You need to have a better understanding on um, content and keywords, uh, what kind of keywords are people are searching for, because there's no point of ranking on Google if nobody's giving you a call, if nobody is, <clears throat> you know, asking for more information. So that's why we do keyword research before even publishing any website. Oh, I'm sorry. Any website uh, so you can see the results. Okay. Um, once again, my name is Alex. I really hope you find this information useful. If you have any questions, please let me know. But other than that, um, thank you for watching.